Friday, June 16th, 1944. Dear Kitty, new problem. Mrs. Van Dan is desperate, talks about a bullet through her head, prison, hanging, and suicide. She's jealous that Peter confines in me and not her. She's offended that Dussel doesn't enter into her flirtations with him as she hoped, afraid that her husband is smoking all the fur coat money away. She quarrels, uses abusive language, cries, pities herself, laughs, and then starts a fresh quarrel again. What on earth can one do with such a foolish, blubbering specimen? No one takes her seriously. She hasn't any character, and she grumbles to everyone. The worst of it is that that makes Peter rude. Mr. Van Dan irritable and Mummy cynical. Yes, it's a frightful situation. There's one golden rule to keep before you. Laugh about everything and don't bother yourself about the others. It sounds selfish, but it's honestly the only cure for anyone who has to seek consolidation in himself. Crayler has received another call-up to go digging for four weeks. He's trying to get out of it with a doctor's certificate and a letter from the business. Capius wants to have an operation on his stomach. All private telephones were cut off at 11 o'clock yesterday. Yours, Anne. That was uh, Friday, June 16th, 1944.